do you want to be able to do this to people? Or this to people who have single digit MS? Or this to players on the leaderboards? If you answered yes to any of these questions, you might want to watch this video. Alright, let's get started. You may be wondering, what is S-tapping exactly? Well, so S-tapping is when you hit a player and you press S and then you press W. You press S, W, S, W. You just keep inching up a little bit. You press S to either back yourself up or you press S to stop. So like they're taking knockback, you're hitting them, and then backing out or holding S so that you're out of their hit range. But you want to press W too when you're moving up so that they're in your hit range. All right, I know that's kind of difficult to comprehend, but I'll show a video right now of me doing it. I feel like it'll make a lot more sense once I show you. All right, so before I get into the clips, I'm going to show you guys what it looks like IRL. I feel like if you guys can see what I'm doing exactly IRL, it'll be more uh, helpful for you guys to get this down. So yeah, I'm going to show you guys that, and then I'm going to explain what I'm doing in that clip as well. All right, so this is how S-tapping looks IRL. What you want to do is you hold W like normal, and then you let go of W, press S for a second, and then you just keep, keep pressing W and S, like, just like this. Ready? It's going to be at different speeds, uh, depending on who you're fighting, but you're going to have to have your middle finger on the W key and your pointer finger on your S key. Or, I mean, whatever finger you want to use. I mean, I don't know why you'd use a different finger other than these two, but it's just like this. So you press at, you press, you hold W, and then you press S to back up. Just like this. It's pretty easy. Alright, so the timing, you pretty much want to press S as soon as the player is about to turn red. That's like the perfect time to do it. As you'll see in this video that's playing right now, I'm pressing S literally right when he turns red and I hear that like, like that, that hit sound. You know, you know what I mean. Notice the positioning. Notice how he's straight in front of me. Like he's like directly aligned with me, if that makes any sense. And I keep it. Th I keep him that way the entire combo. Even when I turn, I like stay where. So he's like straight from me, if that makes any sense. I'll, I'm gonna keep replaying this clip so you guys can look at what I mean. But you have to have him like this if uh, you want to keep the combo. Like it's it's hard to explain, but you get the gist. I feel like. Alright, so I'm going to be explaining when you should be S-tapping, because you, it's not just like W-tab, and you can't just spam it the whole fight. Like, you have to time it, and it's only specific scenarios that you can do it to. So, in my opinion, there's pretty much four um, scenarios where you can do it. Um, the best scenario to do it is when they're turning around. As soon as they're turning around, like, to pot, like, as soon as they're, like, potting, S-tap. Like, as soon as they're about to turn back at you, that is the perfect time, in my opinion. Um, if they're moving backwards, and, like, you kind of already have them, like, a, they're a bit farther away from you, like, they're about to get, they're about to go in a combo, that's a really good time to do it. That's when, uh, that's when I do it, that's when I did it in that boxing clip that I showed you guys. Um, if their back is facing you, that is also an, an amazing time to S-tap, I highly recommend that, if their back is facing you. Because you're out of their hit range, if you know what I mean. Same for when they're turning around. And also, if their side is facing you, can work too. Although that one's going to be pretty difficult to pull off. You have to be pretty skilled to do that. Um, I mean, I've gotten that down, I feel like. But for new players, that's probably going to take a lot of practice to get down. 
All right, so this next thing I'm going to show you guys is, in my opinion, the most unstoppable move in this game. Um, if you ever watched any of my videos, especially that uh, Stimpy video, you might have noticed that I used pretty much all my pearls. And why I do that is because there's this move I like to do called the side pearl S-tap, or uh, behind pearl S-tap, I guess you could call it as well. I like to call it the side pearl S-tap. But what it is, is you pearl to the side of the player, and then you S-tap. Or you pearl behind the player, and you S-tap. Now... What this does is you're purling behind them, so you're out of their crosshair completely. And you're about to get them in a combo too. So like when you land, you immediately S-tap, and now they're taking KB and you're backing up, and they're just not even going to be able to lock onto you in time. And then boom, they're automatically in a combo. And this works on pretty much everybody. Like, I don't think I've fought anybody who can stop this, to be honest. Like, here's an example I'll show you guys right now. This player was number 7 on the, on the leaderboards last season. Zim's Vazarella. I was just, I literally just recorded this today. Um, this is me doing it against him, and like I said, it literally works on anybody. Here, I'll show you right now. Alright guys, that's going to wrap up the S-Tab video. If you guys like this, if this helps you guys, uh, just drop a sub. I'm going to be starting a series where I just upload videos like this on my channel. I'm going to try to cover all like the fundamentals of like movement and just random shit that will make you good at the game. Like My next video is going to be on movement and like, strafing and W-Tapping. I'm going to go super in-depth on that, just like in this video. So if you guys are really trying to get good, I recommend dropping a sub. And, uh... Just keep it a lookout for the next video from me that's uh, in the tutorial series. Because I think my next video is going to be my pack folder for my 2K special. But, uh, yeah. Thanks, guys, for 2K. Um, hopefully you guys like this new series I got coming up. And, yeah. Peace.